too close for comfort, Sean? No, no, it's two points. It's what we come to get, and we didn't play well in, in both games, but we've got four points. Um, so it's a decent start for us, but we understand, and I understand, we need to improve for next week. Mm. So job done. Played ugly and won. Where do you think you were particularly lacking tonight? Um, I thought our finishing some of our skill was poor. I thought they controlled the play of the ball. We're, we're good when we're playing fast, and they control the ball, usually. And the referee allowed them to do that, which was disappointing. Um, every time the ball come out, it was a penalty against us and knock on when we did it. So I thought, I thought it was poor, but credit to them, you know, young team, people injured, I thought they played really well, players and guts, but they was allowed to do so. You know, they, they played smart with the referee. I was slightly surprised, Sean, that they've got two very inexperienced guys on their left, you know, young Sam Ward and Jeremy Foster coming back into rugby league after a break. I was a bit surprised you didn't attack a bit more down down that side, really. Yeah, I'm, I'm a bit surprised with the few areas of the, of the team of the of the team where we could have attacked better, but we didn't. Um, I thought our skill was a bit sloppy. I thought there was a spell when our completions were about 50%, which is not Wigan. Um, you know, but we could have been smart in order to about that. But you know, losing George yesterday affected us because we trimmed with Sam in, in, in dummy half all week, so that did affect us. But just just dummy in the important part. But you know, we can take some credit for that that we played poorly in two games and got two wins. So we showed some. Toughness today, but I don't want to take anything away from Huddersfield. His, his players uh, stood up and, and really tested us today. Well, George, did all right next week. Yeah, he's fine. He, he would like that today, um, but he just, uh, I just had a gut feeling not to risk him. What was his problem in shoulder? Uh, just a, a man of shoulder injury. Right. Do you think the boys might have been thinking about next week a little bit? Maybe Saints last night as well. Yeah, yeah. The, the way, the, watching what they did, they did some things which are not not my team, and I, I think there's a little bit of that. You know, they're all. Excited about next week. It's a big, big game for us. But you know, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty easy. I'm, I'm just one game at a time, and that was important one for me today. But I was just glad to get the two points. It was up against it. You know, there's a few calls went against us, and you know everything was going the the way. And they were playing really well. You know, credit to them. They played some great, great rugby league. But we just, um, we just can't do that to ourselves. And we didn't attack well. We still scored 18 points. So there's some positives. You know, I know we need to improve, and and. Uh, I'm very happy sat here with four points and not played that well. Are you in a better position to play? Uh, well, we, we'll improve. I'm going to show what Kevin said last night. We, we, we will improve. We'll have to improve. You know, our goal line D uh, wasn't, wasn't Wigan style today. So I think we're well placed. I think we're better shape than what it was last year. I think we'd have lost that game last year. Um, I thought we showed some toughness. So, you know, we're looking forward to uh, getting into Brisbane next week and, and seeing how they go. Last year, you were. You know, just lost very, very narrowly to Brisbane. Uh, Sean, it would be really great to get on the other side of that scoreline. Yeah, so, yeah. Shocking decision at the end of the game. Yeah. We'll all agree. A terrible decision. Never yeah. happened in Australia. Um, you know, and I thought I played short from toughness, and they played tough. I thought mm. they was good Brisbane last year, and it was a real good middle battle. And I didn't want it to be decided on referees' call, and I don't think Brisbane did either. But unfortunately, it was. So you know, we were proud of how we played, but at the end of the day, they won. And I'm only in to win these games and you know and so my players. So we'll be we'll be pumped. I'm gonna give the players a little bit of time off for the weekend. You see the wives on on Sunday, then we're back into work and every day is gonna be full on. And these are sort of wives, thanks. Yeah, every everybody's good. There's no there's no uh, injuries at all. There's a couple of split eyes and things like that, but nothing major. Sean, has anyone uh, any players Below the normal standards, where you consider making selection changes? Um, <laughs> not really, no. No, I thought you know, I thought in patches we did some, we did some good things. We just weren't consistent, you know. I thought we forced players when we don't normally force players, and that's why we and come, come up with errors. So, you know, it's uh, we just need to be a bit smarter. We need to be smarter. We we have to take the referee at the equation by pushing and fighting a bit more and better play the ball technique because we're not going to get any help. So um, we just need to be smarter. Was there a sense in which you might have underestimated them tonight with their injury situation? Without yeah, well, it's been in the rest. papers all week, and uh, everybody's re ready. The referees are ready. Everybody's read the, the situation, and you know we was without a few numbers as well. You know, don't forget that we have five starters out, so we can improve. And uh, I, I think there was a little bit of that. It's human nature that if so many people mentioned it to us, then uh, I think whether the players accepted or not, I think a little bit went into the minds. Of those guys missing, is Williams the only one who will be back? Yes. 
yeah, a lead muscle, you're going to play for a reserve 